7 reasons why you need to start investing today. The best time to start investing is right now. But maybe you keep telling yourself you'll invest when you make more money. Or maybe you're sitting on the sidelines waiting for a better time to take the plunge. Here's the thing, putting it off could cost you more than you realize. By waiting to invest, you could be missing out on some potential sweet financial gains. In fact, when you start investing, could make a bigger difference on the amount you end up with than how much you actually invest over time. So the sooner you put your dollars to work, the more you're likely to benefit in the long term. If you still need a reason to get started, here are 7 of them. Number 1. Compound Interest Not only time is your best friend when you're investing, but you'll also reap the benefits of something called compound interest, a phenomenon the genius Albert Einstein coined as the hate wonder of the world. Who understands it, earns it, who don't, pays it. Now this is how compound interest works. Your money makes money and then you make more money on the money your money makes. For you to get a better understanding, let's look at an example. Say you invest 1000 this year and you earn a 10% return on your money. That means you make $100 on your original investment of $1,000. And as a result, you end up with $1,100. No, but if you don't contribute anything next year, guess what? You will still make money. How is that even possible? Say you earn the same 10% returns on your $1,100 account balance. Instead of you earning $100, you'll actually earn $110 because you're getting that 10% interest on a larger balance. Now you would have $1,210 simply because you let compound interest do its thing. Now that is the beauty of compound interest. Even if you never invested another penny, by starting earlier, you would still come out ahead of someone who chose to begin investing later and even investing larger sums of money. Let's say you had an employee that sat around all day and never brought any value to your business. You would definitely fire them, right? Then why don't see your money in the same way? Your money should be considered as employees that will work for you. So it's definitely time to stop keeping large sums of money in savings account and putting your money to work in an investment vehicle like the stock market. Number 2. Investing gets you ready for retirement. From the last credible publication I've seen, only 9.45% of the working population has a pension fund. No, can you just imagine what percent of the population is actually investing? One of the most important goals of investing is preparing for retirement. I know it might seem boring and probably daunting to think about your life as a retiree, but you will definitely be thanking yourself later when you can retire when you want and go where you want. But if you're not investing, that is not going to be possible. One of the best financial choices you'll make is to plan and save for your upcoming retirement. And you also have to think about your future generation. If you don't prepare for your retirement, then when your grandchildren or children start working, they'll have to be taking care of you financially. And you see how times are really challenging now and it's really difficult for many people to take care of a family. So it would be very hard on them to take care of themselves plus an elderly person who did not invest to take care of their retirement. Number 3. Investing gets you more financial freedom. Do you have a vacation you're dying to take? Maybe you have a home renovation you're planning to do and can't afford it yet. Now the traditional way would be save, 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 save until you can afford it. But when you invest your money, you will be able to achieve your goal faster. Number 4. Investing gets you in the practice of delayed gratification. When you think about it, almost everybody you know wants it now. And the cost of wanting it now, a lot of individuals end up sacrificing their most valuable asset which is time. Sacrificing now for your future can provide you with so many options later. This act of self-control can start a positive chain of events in your life. Would you rather be working to pay for a car or have an investment working for you that pays for the car? Number 5. You'll regret it if you don't. I have never met anyone who said they wish they hadn't started earlier. A big regret for most investors is that they didn't start investing a bit sooner. Even billionaire investor Warren Buffett who famously said, 
Someone is sitting under a tree today because someone planted a tree long time ago and he bought his first stock at age 11. He also wished he had started investing at a younger age. And for those of you who have kids, it's a good idea to start an investment account for them and ensure you contribute to that monthly. This is one way you can give them an head start to life. Number 6. It's okay to make mistakes. Many people avoid investing because they are afraid of messing up. They are afraid of picking the wrong stocks and losing money. But guess what? You are still losing money due to inflation even if you don't invest. Investing isn't this big R thing that you have to spend a ton of time and energy to get right. Now if you can find 2 hours in a day to focus on entertainment like watching a movie, you can also find 2 hours in a day to learn about selecting investments. Number 7. Investing protects your money from inflation. When you invest your money in assets that appreciate or generate a cash flow, you are protecting your money from inflation. With a normal economic performance and a stock market, historically, stock returns have always outpaced inflation. So investing your money in assets is definitely a good way to protect yourself from inflation. When you do this, you don't have to worry too much about rising prices because your money is growing up so you will be able to afford the things that are increasing as well. If you have made it this far in this video and you are not yet a subscriber, what are you waiting on? Thank you for watching.